Announce it, and let it be announced to the whole world that I set neither limit nor measure to my gifts of grace for those who seek them in my heart. Jesus spoke these words to Margaret Mary. St. Margaret Mary certainly knew him personally. She spent as much time with him as she could spare by being in the present moment with him in all of her thoughts, words, and actions. So personal and deep was their relationship that he showed her his sacred heart. She once said, to be consumed in the fires of the sacred heart is to be consumed by the love of the sacred heart. The sacred heart is an inexhaustible fountain and its sole desire is to pour itself out into the hearts of the humble so as to free them and prepare them to lead lives according to his good pleasure. St. Margaret Mary said, He desires that we turn to him with confidence in our wants and to seek his aid at all times. He is a God of goodness and as such loves to do good to us. She said the divine heart is an ocean full of all good things wherein poor souls can cast all their needs. It is an ocean full of joy to drown all our sadness, an ocean of humility to drown our folly, an ocean of mercy to those in distress, an ocean of love in which to submerge our poverty. Devotion to the Sacred Heart of Jesus serves as a constant reminder to imitate Christ's compassion, to actively seek ways to alleviate the suffering of those around us. Just as Jesus instructs in John 12, 34, 35, a new command I give you, love one another as I have loved you.